<laughs> what are you doing, dude? I think I got something wrong with my electrical charger. All the chickens are out again. In the summer when we've got turkeys and chickens, it's 12 buckets. Right now, we don't have any broilers or turkeys, so it's only seven. Sometimes we find funky eggs. That egg looked like it had a balloon knot tied on the end of it, huh? Inside of our chicken coop, we hold 150 chickens in here pretty comfortably. The floor is slatted so their poop falls through. I've never cleaned this chicken coop out once. It's on a it's it's on an axle so we can drive it down the road. Uh, there's 20 nesting boxes in here. We're gonna clean out these boxes. We get about 100 eggs today. Just all goes to the ground. There's, there's good manure and, and, and organic matter in there. What do you have there, bud? An egg that just got laid. It's still wet? Yeah, it's sticky. A little it sticky? It. D. A little bit of Sometimes blood. has a little bit of blood. This okay, put it down. Laid it. Let's go you home. watched him lay it? You watched yeah, her lay yeah, it? Yeah, That's cool. They're like, get out of here, dude. We need to lay these eggs. Heading over to these pigs. Like I said in the last video, these pigs are like less than a month from butcher weight. And this is when they're most unruly. So they've been in here, they've been in this area for about a month. It's probably about an acre or so. It's been super wet, so I haven't been able to get them out of here. But here in the next couple days, I'm gonna get them. They're in this electric wire. 
Here comes old Peacock. He likes to come steal feed from the from these from these piggies. In the next few days, now that we've had some uh, dry weather, I'm gonna move them to this next plot right over here. And we've also got some grass finally growing, so we'll be moving them over here where that grass is real soon. We have 12 feeder pigs. Two of them are actually replacement sows. So they're gilts that we're gonna keep and breed. So we have 10 feeder pigs out there that are gonna be going to our farm share members as well as our freezer. We'll probably put two in our freezer. Um, we've put three in our freezer before and still run out every year. Um, but I'm very excited to try this red wattle meat. Haven't had that ever, I don't think. And they, uh, they definitely have a different body shape, the red wattles do. Um, man, I hit these guineas sometimes. They just don't shut up. Um, the, the meat's supposed to be darker on the red wattle. They're a very desirable breed as far as the quality of the meat. So I'm very excited to see what that looks like, get my hands on it. Um, but yeah, these pigs are brutes right now. Just the sows and sheep are left and rabbits. Headed in for the matures. We uh, got everybody fed, checked on lambs. There's actually about 12 out there. Um, and Amanda went out while I was on the other side of the farm. She said there's something in the house for me. Some kind of surprise. Welp. We've got a bummer lamb. So what are we doing, honey? We are milking this ewe to get some colostrum for a bummer lamb. We think one of our ewes had triplets and uh, the third one isn't uh, isn't keeping up. So this ewe just had these two lambs, that one and that one, like within the last couple hours. So we're trying to steal some colostrum from her and give it to the bummer lamb. See if we can keep that bummer lamb going. So what are you doing? Uh, tube feed on his first meal. We stole that claustrum from carpet back. We just had a couple babies. So he just swallowed that tube. And this is a tube you swallow. And you just syringe mm -hmm. pushing it in there. Mm -hmm. This is the first bummer lamb that's uh, we've had inside this house in four <laughs> years we've been doing this. Did you put regular milk with it? I just, no, I, it was just a combination of Bessie's and carpets and then probably three cc's, cc's of water just to rinse out the colostrum bucket. I just filtered it. It's more than I thought I would have. Mm -hmm. Gotta eat. I just gotta eat every few hours. That's gonna be your job. But and yours. Bye. Yeah. You excited Don't to worry. bummer feed this lamb? Don't you worry. Yes. We're gonna have to do a whole bunch of it. Oh yeah. Every day, every few hours. Alright, that's it. And now she'll sleep. Is it a she? No, it's a he. Yeah. He wants mama. He. he wants mama. He's a little frisky now. 
Yeah, I thought you had a little bit of more, food. More, more, give me more. He's, he's, he's licking, licking and trying to get food from your face. 